Chicago Wednesday back starting next week. And here to tell us about their shows and what you can expect with the new season, we have Joe Minoso from Chicago Fire and Jesse Schramm from Chicago Med. Wow, what a treat to have yeah. both of you this morning. Thank you so much for being here. I know we have Chicago fans galore in yep. this area. So Jesse, we'll start our conversation with you. Chicago Med. Wow. I mean, first of all, what an emotional thrill ride <laughs> through just the day to day yeah. chaos, yes. right? What can yes. you tell us about next yeah. week's season premiere? Ooh, well, we are picking up six months after where we ended, so it's a it's a bit of a new time period. But this first episode will deal with a car accident that floods the ED. So you've got all of our characters, some of us in different positions that we would normally be, and seeing the results from that. We've got a new regime to the hospital because we were dealing with it being sold where we left off. Um, with some characters leaving, we've got some new ones coming in that are brushing elbows and... Ooh, we all have different feelings about it, is all I have to say. Uh -huh. It's revealing things from the past and seeing where things will go in the future. And um, we left off with Archer needing a kidney, and that wasn't happening. And with this... With this so new stubborn, that's not true. No, that's literally what we deal with all the time. <laughs> I mean, Stephen Weber is also pretty stubborn. Yeah, I mean, it's one and the same. Yeah. Yeah. But so Hannah and I have to deal with Stephen and Archer yeah. and have to argue Good again luck. about him getting a kidney. So we'll see what happens there and see where his health goes. Ooh, sounds exciting. Okay, Joe, we want to hear from yeah, you. There's a lot. Yeah. yeah, it sounds like it. Joe, talk to us. <laughs> Chicago Fire is an edge of your seat ride the whole time you're watching. It looks into the professional and personal lives of the firefighters and the paramedics. I understand that the season premiere of your show will have two firehouses being forced to share mm. the same space. Yes, uh, that is indeed the case, and that is because after uh, our very first incredibly high in octane uh, explosion, um, we find out that there is an arsonist who's actually um, singling out firefighters and is coming after firefighters specifically. So thankfully, we have Taylor Kinney back in the role of Kelly Severide to do some fire copying uh, and figure <laughs> out who's down, uh, you know, who's uh, in uh, responsible for all of these fires. Uh, and then, of course, we're going to be figuring out a lot of stuff from last season. Will Brett say yes to Casey? Will Mouch <laughs> survive? Will Cruz accept the fact that now that Kelly is back, he is back in the seat where he's no longer lieutenant mm. uh, or where he decide that he needs to move on and find his own house? Mm. Who knows? Ooh. Who knows? Oh. Uh, so, yeah, there's definitely a lot going to be happening. What, yeah. Now you've got us on the edge of our seats. Mm -hmm. like we really we're are. Me that. too. <laughs> yeah. That was the <laughs> idea. <laughs> right? oh, well, Jesse, let's talk to you a little bit more about your, your character, Dr. Dr. Hannah Asher. Uh -huh. um, because, wow, yeah. first of all, I mean, what an emotional time for her. I mean, love life, battling addiction, mm -hmm. going to rehab, coming out clean. What a storyline in yeah. itself. I mean, how do you even get into character? What have you done to, to really develop Dr. Asher, and then what, I mean, what comes for her this season? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, well, I mean, what what an amazing character to get to dive into, and I mean, the main thing is explore. Mm -hmm. I think there's so much that I can already relate to on a personal level with her, and then a lot of areas of her life not, so I've definitely talked to a lot of people that have experienced addiction or have coached people through it and tried to understand that lifestyle a little bit more and where that is and how we're all affected by it and mainly not just going through it but where she is now um there's never such a thing as completely the other side and so what does that look like on the daily basis and in this new season we will be playing with that more because we've been seeing so much of her fighting to find her ground and fighting to find her position. And now that she's kind of in it, we're seeing what that looks like, not just for her as a professional, but her as a human and her as a person that wants connection and maybe how that deals with her sobriety, but mainly just seeing somebody that's been off the market for a long time as well, dealing with what life looks like when the waters are more calm. And I think it's, it's very interesting so far. Okay, so Joe, NBC says that your character is the beating heart of Chicago Fire. This will be your 12th season. The finale of last season left viewers with a lot of unanswered questions regarding the fates of their favorite okay. characters. Yeah. So, will we get some answers when this airs next week? Oh, 100%. I think I already teased that just sure, a little did. bit. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, but uh, yes, you know, I think you're gonna. F we're gonna find out a lot. Uh, what's crazy about this season? It's uh, there's a lot of evolution happening. There's a lot of change. Like you said, we're gonna be seeing some uh, old faces go and some new faces return. Uh, excuse me. Actually, yes, that's true. New faces return, uh, and new faces just come into the firehouse for the first time. Um, and I think, in general, that's kind of the beauty of this universe. You know, whether or not a lot of characters come and go, the fact that we've been able to create this platform um, for so many incredible artists to come, shine, and then move on and be wanted mm -hmm. by so many other projects uh, is a real gift for us, uh, and it's a pleasure and it's an honor to be able to be a part of that for so long. Um, um, but yeah, it's it's going to be quite the season, uh, to say the least. And we will be finding out for sure about that Casey Brett wedding, and definitely about Mouch. Ooh, okay. Well, I think. The, just the seasons, the amount of uh -huh. seasons that we've had in both of these shows are a true testament to the two of you, the rest of the right. cast of these, mm -hmm. um, and how much fans just love it. Well, you can watch Jesse, by the way, on Chicago Med Wednesday, 8 o'clock, Joe on Chicago Fire at 9. Jesse and Joe, wow, we could have kept talking to you, I but know. I feel like we would have given away too many spoilers. Yeah. Yeah. Let's Spoiler just keep right? the yeah. segments. That's the yeah. point Let's of us having to watch. Going. Do it. <laughs> That's right. Our pleasure. Thank you so much for having us. Thank Absolutely. You. We can't wait to see both of you in the new seasons. Thank you.